think this place has an alarm? Let's try and find a way in that doesn't involve breaking a window. <sighs> All right. Let's look around back, huh? Hey, Nathan, look. It's an open window. Oh, yeah. Here, follow me. Okay, give me your hand. All right, there you go. Come on. Come on, Nathan. I brought a spare. So, are we looking for any particular room? Uh, just keep an eye out for any books, journals, any kind of research papers, you know? Hmm, nothing in here. filled with old traveling and camping equipment. go so how do we find them what mom's notebooks I mean don't you remember she always used that off-white leather binding yeah I know but it's such a large place here we go white leather Sam I think I found one for real no it's not one of mom's you got the right idea, though. Let's keep looking. Hey, Sam. Call me crazy, but this looks like a Ming Dynasty vase. Nathan, who in their right mind would have a Ming Dynasty vase just sitting around like that? Yeah. It's probably a knockoff of some kind. Yeah, of course it is, right? Right.
Uh, we need budge. Here, let's do it together. You ready? Push! 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 What the hell? It's some sort of sarcophagus. Yeah. Look around. This whole place is filled with sarcophaguses. Or sarcophagi. Sam, this is real. What is this place? Well, let's go find out. <laughs> Hey, do me a favor. When I die, bury me in one of these. Sure. Can I mummify you and put your organs in a jar, too? On second thought, maybe not. Hmm. And you recognize that one? Uh... I, I've seen something like it before. Reclining figures. It's Etruscan. Ah, uh, that's right. Yeah. Husband and wife. Buried together. It's kind of dark. And like in an awesome sort of way. <laughs> yeah. Organ jars. <laughs> cool. Huh, this one's Roman. Third, maybe fourth century. This place is like a damn museum. <laughs> Think they've got a dinosaur wing? Wouldn't surprise me. Another one. <sighs> nope. I do believe this is an ancient Mesopotamian washer dryer combo. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I was the funny one. Always was. Hey, Nathan, check me out. Now, who am I? Huh? Dr. Livingston, come on! <laughs> <laughs> nice. Man, what I wouldn't 
give to get an invite like this. Hey, check it out. <laughs> Hail Caesar. <sighs> it's hot in there. So where are we going? Huh? Well, if you could go anywhere in the world, where would you pick? Anywhere? Anywhere. Okay, well... Here we go... <laughs> India. Yeah, we'll visit the Taj Mahal. Round and round she goes. Soviet Union. Let's go to Moscow. Yeah, it might be a tad difficult to get in. I always wanted to see the Red Square, though. Let's try again. England. Sure would be cool to see Windsor Castle. Right, Sam? Hey, hey, don't look at me. It's not my fault you weren't born yet. It's not like I remember much of it anyways. And it wasn't that cool. Uh-huh. Fertility totems. Hey, why are you a little young to be looking at that self? Aren't you a little old to be making that joke? Yeah. Can you imagine being the one to actually uncover these things? <laughs> Must be something, right? Wow. This table is as big as the ones in the orphanage dining hall. Yeah, I bet the food here was better. <laughs> Wouldn't take much. They must have thrown some great parties in here. Judging by the artifacts, they certainly had enough money for it. Yeah. Looks like it's been a long time since the last one, though. Hey, check out this crazy demon helmet. Is that a Viking helmet? <laughs> Come on. You know Viking helmets don't have horns? It's Persian. Oh. My bad. Flintlock rifles. I wonder if they still work. of Arabia. Jousting armor. Looks French. Maybe you don't go waving your flashlight around the windows too much? A dragon gong. Huh. Looks like it's from Southeast Asia. Going it alone. These compass, sundial. Just imagine being lost at sea. And those instruments are the only things standing between death and salvation.
Hey, they've got your favorite book here. Really? Which one? A general history of the robberies and murders of the most notorious pirates. <gasps> yeah, more like a generally made up history. Even the author's name is a fake. Fake or not, this looks like a first edition. Are you serious? Man, this place, man. Wow. Want to take it with you? <laughs> nah. It'll just disintegrate in my backpack. You could sell it. Then you wouldn't need to take that job. Well, tonight, let's just stick with what already belongs to us. <sighs> hmm, it's locked. Mom's stuff might be in one of these rooms. We gotta find another way in. I really don't think the journals are here. We should find a way up to that vent. Oh, yeah. That could get us into the room below it. Not us. You. What? I, I can't fit in there. Can you handle it? You kidding me? Can't handle it. All right. Let's see what you got then. Oh. Yeah, I really don't think the journals are here. We should find a way up to that vent. <laughs> Since when do you like classical music? Excuse me, I am a man of many tastes. Yeah, I really don't think the journals are here. We should find a way up to that vent. Damn it. Journals about everything in the world, but nothing from Mom. It's a big house. Don't give up yet. <laughs> Are you ready? Polaroid. Yeah, let me see. Yeah, I think it still works. Yeah, come here. A smile, all right? <laughs> Don't lose it.
Okay. Up here. Hey, don't fall. Oh no! Okay, I'm in. <sighs> Coding. Lots of painkillers. <sighs> it's locked from this side, too. And look around. Is there a key nearby? Well, that's sad. Got it. Anything? Didn't see any journals. All right, well, we still got the other locked door, so come on. <sighs> wow. Uh, journals galore. Well, let's see what we find.
Wow. <laughs> Sam. Well, you got something? <gasps> this is it. <laughs> Which is a paradise? Henry Avery, Gunsway Heist. Oh, what do you got there? I've never seen this one. Yeah, me either. But that, you know, that's definitely Mom's handwriting. Put up your hands. Slowly. Hey, 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 there's no need for that. What is he holding? Hey, 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 you keep your gun on me. Give me my journal. <laughs> all right, all right. All right. I'm sorry, Nathan. So what now? Now, we wait uh, for the police. Yeah, you don't want to have to deal with that headache. Stop. I mean, the hassle of ruining two kids' lives, that's... I really don't want to shoot you. Come on, lady. It was no harm, no foul, all right? We all must face the consequences for our actions. Hm. And at least let him go. I brought him down here so he could see our mom's stuff. That's it. He had nothing to do with this. What? I'm telling you that this is all on me. No. Your mother's stuff. Yeah, that, that journal. It was our mom's. You're Cassandra Morgan's boys. Uh. <gasps> hi? My God. <coughs> I could have shot you. Yeah. You still might, so, uh, do you mind? You knew her mom? She worked for me. As I'm sure you've noticed, I'm a collector of sorts. <laughs> That's sort of an understatement. So... Mom was like your translator? Your mother was the most brilliant historian I have ever met. We could have accomplished so much together. But then her illness... And... I'm sorry. It's all right. Happened a long time ago. Of all her discoveries, this would have been her crowning achievement. Sick Parvis Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. Sir Francis Drake's motto. Yeah, Latin and historical figures. <laughs> Those were our dinner conversations. We were, uh, a weird family. Did she ever tell you her theories regarding Sir Francis Drake and his heirs? Uh, Sir Francis Drake didn't have any heirs. Yeah. That's what history tells us. But your mother and I believed otherwise. 
Learning that old pirate's secrets is just one more adventure I have to let go. I guess there's a lot I have to let go. <laughs> Forgive me. Ramblings of an old woman. as much yours as it is mine. Who knows? Perhaps one day you'll be able to finish what she started. Uh, yeah, so, uh, we're off the hook, right? I'll handle the police. You found your way in. I trust you can see yourself out, hmm? Yeah. Thank you. Sorry about the mess. <laughs> All right, come on, Nathan. Let's go. Are you okay? Holy shit. Hey. 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 Sam? Sam? Oh, Khalid, you all right? Wait, we have to do something. Yeah, we need to get the hell out of here. You can't just leave her here. There's nothing we can do for her, all right? We have to run. If the cops find us here, then this. Sam? Nathan! We gotta go, right now.
The chimney. Come on. Come in. The front gate looks clear. Front gate. Got it. They're on the ground somewhere. Okay. I'd say we're clear. But we catch our breath for a second. Some night, huh? Some night. That old lady. Hey. Hey, you listen to me. That wasn't our fault back there. And that lady, she, she was, um, sick. I mean, it's okay to feel bad, but there was nothing we could do about it. So what are we gonna do now? I can't go back to the orphanage. You can't go back to your job. Then we don't. Sure. No, I'm serious. We get as far away from this place as we possibly can. Yeah? And how long till the cops find us? Well, I think they'll be looking for Nathan and Samuel Morgan. Yeah, that's us. What if it wasn't? Nathan, back at that mansion, you knew just as much about that stuff as that poor old lady. Here. I always felt that we were destined for something great. But until tonight... I didn't know what that meant. But this... Mom's unfinished work. This is our chance to restart our lives. With brand new identities. What are you talking about? I know some guys. Pretty good at forging papers, too. Now, as for our new name... Mom believed that Sir Francis Drake had heirs. Who's to say he didn't? You're serious, aren't you? Nathan, we were meant for this. And I promise, you and me together, we're gonna go far. So what do you say? Nathan Drake? Everything changed after that. You know, we became explorers, adventurers, and mostly thieves. Ow. Okay, just hold still. 
You know, for a while, it felt like you know, if we weren't taking turns going to jail, it was because we were in jail together. And you know, after I lost him, I, after I thought I lost him. You didn't want to bring him back up again. Something like that. Well, that's it. Now you know everything. With you, I doubt that that's everything. But... It's a lot. Love to know what you're thinking. I'm thinking that you're lucky that I found you when I did. Yeah. I'm glad you didn't lose a limb or anything. <coughs> it would have been a royal pain getting you out of here. How did you uh, find me anyway? Oh, you know, easy. Just follow the sound of gunfire. <laughs> No, I mean, how did you get here? Oh, of course. <laughs> Come in, Sully. Hey, darling. How's he doing? Oh, you know, he's banged up, but he's alive. Par for the course. Now we just need to rescue the other Drake. What do you mean? I'll let Nate tell you. Hey, pal. Glad you could join us. Yeah, I wouldn't miss it. So what happened to Sam? Rafe's got him. Shit. You know where they are? Uh, yeah. They're headed to the northern side of the island. See if you can find a place to set down over there. Once we get Sam, we're gonna need to get out of here pretty quick. Copy that. Hey, hey what about the treasure? Forget it. We don't need it. But Alcazar... No, there is no Alcazar. It's all bullshit. Wait, you mean the dip, the... The escape? Yeah, Sam made it all up. What an asshole, right? Look, I'll fill you in on everything when I see you, okay? Yeah, I can't wait. Look, you two be safe down there. You know us. Jaja. Thanks. Sure? No, I mean, thanks for saving me again. I almost didn't this time. Right. Come on. I got us a ride. So, we're headed to the northern side of the island?